is up guys, this is the third video today and uh, I'm going to do my SummerSlam predictions with Marix. I've got them right there, right in front of me. <laughs> uh, as you've just seen, uh, I mean Superman FC game, we're battling out to, uh, to become the first NXT uh, predictions championship. So let's see who wins that one. So starting off is a crew... Akuzuri Kuzari uh, with Titus O'Neil Reese uh, Neville uh, for his rematch for the Cruiserweight Championship. Avaka Kuzari is going to win because T Titus O'Neil and uh, no, uh, Kuzari has just recently became uh, the uh, champion and Avaka is going to lose it. And uh, for uh, Marik, he has predicted Kuzari too. Uh, so both of them predicted the same person there. So next match now is the New Day. Uh, so Biggie and Xavier Woods uh, will be battling out with uh, this one with Kofi Kingston at ringside. Mm -hmm. Reese D. So Jay and Jimmy Uso for the tag team, the tag team uh, championship, the WWE SmackDown champ team. Has yeah. Um, so uh, I'm predicting. Uh, for the new champions, uh, the Usos. Win the back. Yeah, Usos straight away are going to win the back. Uh, coming out the bigger side and the better side. But uh, Maverick has uh, gone different to me this one, and he had predicted the new day. He had said because they have just recently won it, they're going to lose it straight away. So basically, the preserve reason what I said. So next one, I'm predict it's the Hardy Boys and Jason Jordan reach the Miz and the Miz Taraj, Bo Dallas and Curtis Axel with uh, Maurice at ringside uh, in a six-man tag team match. I'm predicting the Hardy Boys and Jason Jordan because they're far better, a far better side. And uh, uh, yeah. And that's the only reason. And he has somehow predicted uh, the Miz Taraj and the Miz uh, for some random reason. He said, uh, uh, because uh, he, he has been predicted during the Mihar Rise somehow. Uh, and he said, I'm going to get lucky with that one. So let's see. Next one is the big one. Rock Lesnar with Paul Heyman. Reese Roman Reigns. Reese Samoa and Joe, Reese Braun Strowman. Right, in a fatal four-way match for the WWE Universal Championship. So, yeah, let's get right into it. Uh, coming up now, I, I am predicting Samoa Joe. I predicted him last time, but I am going to predict him right this time. This maniac is a coin! Samoa Joe, I am predicting no matter what. And he has predicted uh, for the title to change hands, uh, Roman Reigns. And if you guess this match right, you will get two points. Uh, so, yeah, uh, he has predicted Roman Reigns because he said he's going to uh, win it up to WrestleMania. I um, uh, But I am predicting Samoa Joe. Next match is Naomi vs Natalia in a singles match for the WWE SmackDown's Women's Championship. I'm predicting uh, Naomi still gonna win, uh, still gonna stay strong because Natalia had a, a chance going up to her after she rolled her up at uh, SmackDown, and he has also predicted Naomi to stay the champion. So next match is Alexa Bliss v Sasha Banks in a singles match for the WWE Raw Women's Championship. Uh, I'm predicting Sasha Banks. I reckon she's actually going to win it at a pay-per-view for once. I'm going to hold it until Bailey's back from injury or Nia Jackson might win the offer. But he has predicted Alexa Bliss. He said E4, uh, she's going to win it until all the women are going to have a fatal six-way uh, match. But, and that is so interesting. And next match is one of the favourite matches. 
it's going to be Jinder Mahal with the same brother, with Shinsuke Nakamura. I'm predicting Shinsuke Nakamura to become the new WWE champion. And that, and he has predicted Jinder Mahal. He said he's going to get lucky. He said uh, Baron Corbin might... Um, a uh, Baron Corbin might distract Nakamura or Jinder Mahal might uh, help him again. No, not Jinder Mahal, Greg Carly. So that's how he's been scratched. So next is AJ Styles with Kevin Owens for the sing- singles match for the WWE United States Champion and Shane O'Mac, the uh, GM, uh, will be will serve as special guest referee. And Sorry for this is the conclusion which I'm having. Will Shane O'Malley return on Kevin Owens or AJ Styles? Yeah, I am predicting Kevin Owens to become the new the WWE United States Championship because uh, after AJ Styles, I had a feud with uh, Shane O'Malley uh, at WrestleMania, and then Pelly kicked him on purpose uh, because. No, on perfect. No, <laughs> uh, so that's why I'm predicting Kevin Owens. But he has predicted Kevin Owens too. Next match is Rusev vs Randy Orton in a singles match. I'm just predicting Randy Orton because he has to come back from uh, those pay-per-views losing to Jinder Mahal. <laughs> and uh, triple my up. No, one sec, one sec. Let me say my lips. Uh, and Marek saying Rusev because uh, it's his first ever pay-per-view here at SmackDown Live. I think he's going to win it. No second pay-per-view. What you kind of feel? Now let me give to Triple Man up to game in. Wouldn't you kind of feel bad for Rusev though? Because he's just lost to John Cena. He needs to win more than Randy Orton. Mate, Randy Orton's already a, like 11-time world champion. What's Rusev? A two-time USA champion. Everybody, give a round of applause for Rusev. Like next Triple Man FC gaming yet again. <laughs> uh, so next is Big Show vs Big Cat in a singles match, Clash of the Titans. But this is unusual uh, because Enzo Enzo Amore butted in. It's gonna be Enzo Amore will be suspended above the ring in a shark tank. Yep, in a shark tank. Uh, and I'm predicting Big Show. He's one of my favourite wrestlers. I reckon he ain't given down even with a broken arm. But he's a big cat because Enzo Mori might be suspended. But he ain't going to stop the club of distracting him and uh, uh, make him uh, try to attack them. So next match is Bray Wyatt with the demon Finn Balor in a singles match. I'm predicting the demon Finn Balor because after losing and getting humiliated by uh, Bray Wyatt with that fake blood. And that is why. And he has also picked demon Finn Balor because he said after winning the United uh, uh, Universal Championship, he has not even accomplished anything else. And that is true. And next is John Cena vs. Baron Corbin. Uh, he has put in a singles match. He has predicted John Cena because he said he's going to not uh, lose a match until he faces Shinsuke Nakamura for the WWE Championship or Jinder Mahal, he said, uh, whoever wins. But I said Baron Corbin because after him getting distracted by John Cena and uh, getting his uh, money to bank cash in to be a fool uh, and make them look like a fool too. Uh, I was a Baron Corbin going to stop at nothing to win John Cena. And let me give you to Triple my C Gamer to show a uh, question on that. But there is a small chance because some fans pointing out that like, Corbin's shoulder is up so he could get his money in the bank back off that. Alright guys, next. Alright, next is Cesaro and Sheamus. Cesaro, uh, Reese, Dean Ambrose and Seth Rollins, the Shield for the... Tag team match for the WWE Raw Tag Team Championship. I'm predicting the Shield. I reckon, uh, no, I do want some more jewels to win you, but Roman Reigns might win you 
Then being on boats and Cephalon and Roman Reigns will all reunite the dead all with the champions. Instead of Dean and Bros having the end tag team run, uh, he's, he's going to be swapping with Roman. So I'm predicting the shield. And it, he has put it Cesaro and Sheamus to defend the champion champions. But it's the next pay-per-view. Whoever they read, uh, they might lose it. So yeah, these are my SummerSlam 2017 predictions. Uh, hit the like and subscribe. Since then, p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p p